I didn't even think. Uh oh, babe, I'm gonna have to turn your music down a bit. Oh, don't go back, back over yet. Go on up and don't, cause they're gonna be getting on the interstate on the first loop. Yeah. Yeah. How are you? Cause girlfriend laptop is dead. I am taking it to the doctor and it has to go to the doctor a whole hour and 20 minutes away. So we're on the road. How are y'all on hump day Wednesday? Hey, Marcos. Marcos, why are you all up in my bedroom? Why are you up in my bedroom, Marcos? You are running still right now in my bedroom and we're on the road. <laughs> Fun with the girls. Both of y'all are running right now in my bedroom. You need to stay at my bedroom, a married woman. <laughs> But you are running. One percent, you are running. Because did you check your DM? Because this morning when I woke up, I wanted to put um to let you know where I was on on my as far as running it. Y'all, I got pimples all over my face. Look like mm, girlfriend. Look. Mm. Oh God, they don't stop putting it back out again because mm -hmm. they stopped. So how are y'all? I heard y'all say y'all doing good on hump day. Y'all, who is ready for Christmas? This year, guys, believe it or not, I'm actually excited for Christmas. And usually I am not excited for Christmas because my kids are older. But because this year I have been doing some sneaking. Bless. My kids are older. My oldest one is 22. The next one is 20. And my baby girl, which is right there. Mama's twin. Yes, Marcos. You know I sent it to you on DM. Girlfriend, don't play. I done had enough of people. Thank you. I done had enough of people to say, hey, you know what? They say, hey, Amber. They say hello. Girlfriend's sick. She was out ever since Monday. So she's going to the doctor while I'm had to take my laptop too. Hey, look. You know we need to get up together, right? You know we need to get up together. You you read than Augusta. And I'm 30 minutes away. We need to get together. Thank you so much. I don't know what it is, guys. I don't know what it is, but this kid has been going with high fevers. Um, she's not anything got to do with a cold. I don't know what it is. So I was like, mm mm. Hubby got off work this morning. I was like, no, she is going to the doctor. We got to go all the way back to South Carolina. But she's going to the doctor because whatever she got, sister girl don't want it. Okay. So we got to find out what's going on. So I am running some playlists. And, but you know what, bless, this been going on with her ever since last Friday. So I know it's not 24 hour and I'm an RN, so I know kind of like what to look for. So it's not a 24 hour, this has been going on, but she was born a sick baby. Um, and she also has lupus and she is a very bad anemic so um she's been getting dizzy and almost to the point of passing out Riri. thank you my love thank you I, I why didn't you dm me and tell me that because you know girlfriend i'm a, i'm one of them this man about to get a hook up under this truck already look like an old scraggly let me shut up <laughs> get ready to get hooked up under this truck. Yeah, I'm not going to watch it when they were going. Oh, let me tell you. The first one in my family to find out I had lupus. Um, How it came about to me to find out I had lupus, I was eight months pregnant with this little kid. And I was in a bad car accident. 
And while I was in that car accident, I ended up going to the immersive room and I stayed in the immersive room for 16, well, not immersive. Hey, S. Collins. Hey, my love. Um, I ended up in the hospital overnight for 18 hours to make sure everything was fine with me, everything was fine with her, because they literally had to take the steering wheel from off of my car to get my stomach from under there. So, um, that's when I found out I had lupus. And they also did a lupus test with my baby after she was born, but it wasn't detected until she was three and a half months old so she has gone through the warts she has gone through losing hair she has gone through not being able to sleep at night just being sick so whenever something is going on that i feel like okay yeah we need to go on to the doctor i just say okay we go into the doctor so after her being like this and of course we've been driving back and forth to north carolina and then she's going back to school i don't know what she's probably picked up from the hospital there so i mom this mom is not taking any chances this mama is taking her to the doctor so we are going to the doctor to drop this kid to see what is going on see if it's contagious because it's contagious she's gonna be quarantined to her bedroom because girlfriend is not trying to feel it at all okay i still got some christmas stuff to purchase but exactly and like my husband he's hard-headed he's a police officer and i keep telling him okay you constantly have criminals in your car and stuff and he'll come home he'll see my husband i think he's the biggest baby of them all i could be in my classroom riri guess what going to the shop my laptop will not come on guys It'll come up. Hey, TMC fam. Hey, my love. Um, look at my lipstick, y'all. Mm. Hey, Lola. Oh, my God. <laughs> but I'm taking my laptop. Um, The other day, Virgo, I was on Virgo Live, and she was like, oh, you know what? Let's check the hours. So I lean over, grab my laptop. I'm great. How are you? I'm clicking my laptop on and sister just sitting there swirling. I'm like, okay, I know Wi-Fi is on. I know Wi-Fi is paid. I know Wi-Fi. Thank you. My lip gloss is um Too Faced. You know what? Wait a minute. <clears throat> this is the one that stays in my bag all the time. Look at me. I got to dig through my... Y'all don't want to know what my pocket would look like inside. It's this. It's Too Faced. And it is Melt um, Latex. They no longer sell the latex. So if you go to like Alter or Sephora, they have it, but it's not latex. But this color is... Girlfriend and got on. Hey, Mr. Wise. Now, see, Mr. Wise, you cannot complain this time because I got my, my whole fat face up on here, okay? You always complain. I only see your chairs. Now, see, you see my face. Um, I don't know. Yo, hello, my. Re -re, I ain't got my. Hey, Virgo, boo. I just call your name. Virgo, I just call your name, okay? Girl. Yo, I don't have on my glasses. I can't see that writing. It's called Stranger Love. That's that strange love. That's the name of it. You didn't do nothing. I was telling them that other day we were on your live and we started talking about how to count your hours and stuff. You pick up your tablet, your tablet acting crazy, and then my laptop, Virgo, is in my lap. It's going to the doctor. I got to find out what's going on with it. I will Riri. I I DM you. Um, it's going to the doctor because I'm like, mm mm. I I got to have my laptop. I'm on the iPad now. Mm mm. Hi Pam, Pine and Ginger, to the doctor. Okay. Other than that, husband will be buying me a new MacBook. A serious. See there. <laughs> he said he pumping gas. He will be buying a new MacBook. Okay. And I don't want a last year version. I want this year version. Okay? Because girlfriend cannot go without 
her stuff. So I don't know what's wrong with this bad boy, but it would not let me get past there. I don't try to restart it and whatever. I'm like, mm -mm. I'm going to take it back. Let her know. I has been a good wife all year long. I deserve a MacBook. I deserve the one that just came out, but I don't think you could be paying $4,000 for that bad boy. That bad boy. <laughs> Tell him. I, look. I called Apple Riri. They didn't know what was going on, so they told me to take it to a technician. So, what I decided to do is take it to where I purchased it from. So, they look at it. So, therefore, if it ain't gonna do right, I'm gonna leave it right there with them. Trade it in because where I bought my MacBook, I can trade my MacBook in and get a newer version or uh, 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 whatever. This sucker's a pro, okay? Uh uh, no. Girlfriend got to have her stuff. So, and on top of it, see, I've been listening to kids. They don't never know when I'm standing real close to their bedroom door. Yeah, I hope he ain't on my live because then I'd be telling myself, guess what, guys? One of my sons giving me the um, Final Cuts Pro for Christmas. I already know I heard him talking. That's $300. Now I'm like, dang, what the heck am I going to get him? I, I, I got a good feeling, everybody, what I'm getting for Christmas. Hey, Swag. Hey, my girl. Lady Swag. Hey, I, 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 I don't know. Hubby, he already know. I done told him what he's getting for Christmas. Yes, Mr. Wise got to have it. Got to have it. Look at that. He just must get up in my camera, y'all. Must get up in the camera. Come on, boo. We got to hey. be there by 345. Come on. You know you drive like a senior citizen. That's a story. That's <laughs> <laughs> you. That's a lie. You know that's a story. He know like, that's a lie. I'm like Jeff Gordon when I Hey get fam, oh, fun by eight. Man, you put my husband out, out on dollars and five hundred, honey. My husband I'm, still I'm like be Jeff Gordon. you. You still be see they about to hit them people a little rag of the truck. I'll be like Jeff Gordon if you get me on that Darlington race track. I'm telling about it. Ask Collins. He be like. I am the law, and no. I don't supposed to be driving fast because it like, doesn't look good for a police to pull over like, a police. You like, ain't in no uniform. I go like Jeff Gordon when I'm on the highway. Okay, Jeff Non Gordon. <laughs> Jeff Non Gordon, you. Ain't like, I done told him, look, when we got to go somewhere, ain't like we in a high speed chase. We got to go. <laughs> uh, also, don't let this en route. <laughs> Yeah, that's for the first to go back yeah. that um um Atlanta and we go into South Carolina. So we the next one. Y'all I'm telling my husband, look. Don't believe her, y'all. Don't believe her, y'all. I'm like Jeff Gordon when I get out So here. who do y'all believe? Don't listen to her. L slow? Or no L, L fast. Nah, that ain't no L fast. <laughs> yeah, right. What you always say, oh I don't worry about it. I sleep when you drive. How many times have I ever slept when you was driving? I can't, that's me. I can't, that's me. No time. I be praying. We haven't been life. together over three years. I've never went to sleep. All that the, you have gone to sleep. Y'all got, don't. Mm. When I drove. When we went to uh, Florida. When we went to Florida, I didn't go to sleep. I was praying. He was praying. He was asleep. He take him out. Y'all. Let me call him out. See, we went to Florida. We went to Orlando, Florida. The drive was really a six-hour drive, but we got there in eight. No, no eight hours. It was eight that's hours. A was... That's a lie. Now, that <laughs> no, is a it lie. was eight hours. That is a lie. Hey, Keita. That's a lie, y'all. Hey, that's a lie. Don't believe that. Guys. That is a lie. It was eight hours. Nope. Look, Lady Swag, I'm not going to sleep. It might be my final sleep. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I may not wake up. <laughs> so silly. Woo, honey. He be like, I be driving and I be driving safe. Well, you can go. Oh. Oh, y'all, he get mad. But y'all, 
Hubby, I already know what I'm getting him for Christmas. When we was dating, I started him this high price wooden watch collection. Jesus Christ. So, Hubby already know his limit is $200 and that's the watch plus $39 plus shipping. So, that is all he will be getting. A watch. To see if the time is still ticking. See, girlfriend don't wear watches. I, I despise a watch. I can't do a watch. My son was like, Mama, why don't you get an Apple watch to go with your Apple phone? Look, I got enough apples. I go by Walmart and go grab me a green granny apple and I take it along with me. I do not want no watch up on me. Ask Collins. My husband know how I am. He know I'm going to rat, trip, and everything out on him. He knows that. <laughs> oh, he sit here mad, y'all. It stink like that. That dump truck up there, that diesel fuel. Woo! That sucker burning my eyes. I done told you when I arrived. Wait a minute, where is your thing to? There, you need it turn that on. Yours won't even come out. Y'all, I I mess with my husband all the time. I think that's the biggest thing in between us. He gets on my last dang on nerves, y'all. He knows that. I call him my pain in my <laughs> but at the end of the day, divorces are expensive. And then, it's cheaper to keep them. Yeah, it's cheaper to keep me? <laughs> well, that, that, that yeah, because divorcing me, honey, I don't know. Hey, Chola. <laughs> divorcing me, honey, might be about your underdraws. <laughs> uh -uh. Uh -uh. Like Virgo, that. tell him, I done had that talk with you like, girl. Divorce. I'm sick of this man. I'm a <laughs> See, like Virgo, what did I tell you? Hey, Ben, get Virgo, what did I tell you? Whatever I tell you on the phone, I can see it with this man right there. What did I tell you? He getting on my last and cotton picking nerves. I'm going to divorce him. See how I can say it? And I told him, uh uh, no, I'm not one of them riding the bush girls, and I'm not going to tell you. Look, I'm going to tell you whatever I tell you behind your back. I'm a grown 45 year old stink behind one. No, I ain't stink. No, I ain't stink. I ain't stink. <laughs> I'm going to tell you what. Really, though? You're trying to play finger with me. Oh, I ain't that show you. See my little darling deal right here? I'll some Bahama Mamas later on. You know, good man ain't drinking no darn alcohol. I'm fool as it is without well, alcohol. A, what a the virgin. heck I'm going to do with it? get a virgin Bahama Mama. Ask Collins, that's what he just say. It's cheaper to keep her. Um, if you know, if you want to divorce this and the hunt, you better because you're not even going to afford the skin that you're walking in. Because I'm going to take that too. And your toenails. And your yeah, teeth. Yeah, right. I'm going to take it all of it. I'm gonna make sure that you are not left with nothing. If I divorce you, honey, ain't no other woman gonna want you because you're gonna be broke as a joke. Okay? Nah. You can sound like Billy Goat if you want to, but I'm telling you. I always bounce back. <laughs> okay, balls bounce back and they get popped in the middle of the road too, ain't it? All balls don't stay on. Um... Ooh, I just thought about that. All balls don't. Oh, wait a minute. That's right. I say uh, nobody under 18 can view my thing. So therefore, no oh, kids. Oh, you can't get a language memory got on me about that. No, huh? We got it now that we can block 18 and under from coming into our lives and view our stuff. I'm trying to play with YouTube. YouTube ain't trying to. Mm mm. Y'all, y'all see that low and hammer? No, it was bluffing y'all because that was my daughter, my baby doctor calling me. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. He was telling me to come on, but we coming from Georgia. We can't go that fast. My husband driving. All right. <laughs> I get tired of you now. I get tired of you up here saying I drive slow. I'm tired of it. I'm gonna have to do a lot old school wrestling now. Let me tell you, y'all. We were playing one night. He want to wrestle me and my baby girl. And I, I, I held back on him. We wrestle him and his pants was at his knees. <laughs> I, I was like, you mess with the Blake Johnson girls. I, I, you I don't to, know. I, they can still handle me and I had, and I wasn't even going full speed with them. Because this is what I was but Sean, in the corner. boo, baby. You where was your was. pants? Yeah. Sean, where was your pants? Because y'all pulling my pants. No. Down. 
Wait, no, we did not. We bang. No, because I had mercy on y'all. Y'all still could. The Johnson me. girls, look, I'm not who no horn. I ain't trying to be. But if I beat a girl into a coma and she's staying in that coma for three months when I was in the levels grade, what you think? See, I, I held back on her because I was Chola, he's her fine. in the corner. And then the daughter, I was spanking her with the belt. He was spanking, trying to get loose, but he was the one out his pants. Because I was head butting you in, in the corner, and you couldn't do that. Yeah, and when I pop you in the back of your neck, you ran. Y'all, let me tell you, he ran in the bedroom and locked the door. Because, no, uh, no, because. I'm like, do he need an oxygen? Do I need to call 911? These, these two women had iron rods that were coming at me. You think I was going to stand there letting them be? You me? teach your daughter early how to defend so, herself. When they got them iron rods, yeah, I ran. I wasn't going to stand there and let y'all beat me. I ran like hell. Hoppo, you told them to beat me? <laughs> <laughs> but, but they barely could, but they barely could on. Um, <laughs> Daniel, I'm sorry. Oh, you see this man want to get me copyrighted? Man. <laughs> Yo, I, right when I leave home, everybody got to call me. Now that was the that's the 20 year old. Mama, do we have any batteries? Boy, it's more batteries in that house that I. I wish I could hook up one of the. What? Why are you looking at me like that? Now you're trying to take my camera look at him. No, it's just like, why are you looking at me like that? Look at me, you look at you. With them very observant Look at that eyes. devil, y'all. Woo, that's the devil. She got them observant eyes. Very observant. Can y'all hear that music? I don't know if you're still bluffing or not. <clears throat> something I'm about to check my windows in there. Huh? Because something I can get like the wind. I think one of the seals or something. You need to check the seals. Yeah. Y'all, what are y'all purchasing y'all spouse a significant other for Christmas? Yeah. What? Huh? Mm -hmm. oh, I heard you, you say something? yeah. Oh. I don't know about that, S. Collins. I don't know about that. He is nerd and I am food. So together we are, huh? Jules said you don't see batteries. Tell him to look in the dining room in the china closet and the first draw. Batteries are right there. Huh? Y'all forgot. Oh, mama, I know where stuff be at. I can tell y'all what I bought for y'all staying when you was born. I'm like that. I'm mama. We have to keep stuff like that. What are you talking about prepare to stop? Y'all work on this roll at night. Oh Lord, I didn't even see that. Ooh. Lord, y'all, I never ever thought I would live in Georgia, but uh sometimes driving to Columbia, I'd be like, damn, I don't want to go there. I've been trying to, we was gonna move to Orlando, Florida. Not was it Jacksonville, Jacksonville Florida. Boy, the things I done heard about Jacksonville, Virgo is in Florida. Mm -hmm. And you know, I always be on Bam, um, Bambi Live. Uh -huh. Gone, gone. It's on up. They working on the bridge up there. Oh, I know you joking, y'all. Let me see if I can turn y'all around to look at this traffic right. here. Oh. I know they lying. Can y'all see that? Wait, they got to be joking. These people don't know when to. Look. See, blend it, re re. Like, my job was gonna send me. I was a supervisor for Amazon for seven years. Well, that was like, well, we'll pay you $30,000 to relocate if you're going to Jacksonville, Florida. <clears throat> so, say I didn't get that $30,000. Ouch. Oh. Let me see if it stopped bluffing. Lord. Hopefully we're back. Uh-huh. Hopefully we're back on. They working on the bridge back there, guys. And it just knock everything out. Because of those generators. <clears throat> but. Um, when they told us about Jacksonville, Florida. 
Yeah, we was coming up under the bridge back there. They working on the bridge and all those generators knock, knock everything out. Jacksonville, Florida. This is, hey, my boo. You doing it, boo. <laughs> but let me tell y'all, we was going to move to Jacksonville. When my sister-in-law say, yeah, you might wake up in it. Go hell to the no. Girlfriend ain't doing that. And she was like, yeah. And we had wild snakes. Look, I'm black. I don't do snakes, period. And if I see an alligator, it better be a pair of boots or a pocketbook. Because other than that, girlfriend ain't trying to feel that. So therefore, Jacksonville, Florida was out of the thing. And besides that, I was told that Jacksonville is just not the place to be. So I'm like, we're not going there to pay $300,000 for no freaking house. And then here, six months later, I'm saying I want to get the hell out of Dodge. Uh, you don't even have no turnaround period of, I think, we did the right thing of moving to Georgia. And I always say I never wanted to move to Georgia. Believe it or not, guys, I wouldn't even come to Georgia. I was right there in South Carolina. I would go to North Carolina, all different places in North Carolina and everything. But when I moved to Georgia, I end up loving our area. It's a high but expensive place. Woo! But I love it. Um, I can honestly say my husband left one night to go to work and we were in the house and our car garage was up all night long. My neighbor across the street texts me and she was like, uh, you home? And I'm like, yeah. She was like, you know your car garage been up all night long and we never lock our back door to our car garage because you can't get in the car garage. Nobody bother us at all although if they were to enter it would have been some on wheels okay because we got more ammunition than the ammunition store probably okay so therefore they would have been shot right back out the door and the biggest thing guys i love georgia law i learned about georgia law last summer you bring your behind up on my property i can shoot you and go to your funeral and celebrate that's the crazy stuff in South Carolina, if somebody's on your property, you can only, if you shoot them, you take your butt to prison. You have to be inside your house. Yeah, they had to be inside your house in order for you to shoot them. Well, in Georgia, this little boy here walking through our freaking yard, I had my back door open. Yes, set to break, okay? I'm in my kitchen cooking cooking breakfast my baby was sitting in the breakfast room got my back door wide over nice day i'm letting my house air out i'm sitting there my baby's like mama i just saw a man in the yard I'm like what are you talking about then i look up here he is i walk around through our yard to go to the neighbor's house to cut their grass look then on top of let me tell you how ignorant you want to be you gonna call the freaking police on me so here it is i didn't know he called the police which i didn't give a hot cut because mm. i'm in my house i'm on my property the police get there i'm looking up my baby's like mama police here sleep just got up i'm the top of my lungs you better come out here you better get downstairs the officer came up on my back patio, all through my pat my um gazebo, and he was like, uh, ma'am, what is going on? I said, I look up, my back door wide open, my baby girl sitting right there. I'm in my kitchen cooking, and I look up, here a man walking through my yard. I said, my husband is an officer and a pistol sits stay it stays here in the kitchen. If I would have shot him, then y'all would have been looking at me crazy. He was like, okay. I don't know how long you've been living in Georgia, but Georgia law is if you were on someone in premises and you didn't announce yourself or you don't supposed to be on there and they shoot and you shoot them, it's nothing they can be done. Nothing can be done. Nothing but they're a shot person. 
rescue squad pick him up and we leave who good knowledge to know so in the next one I find honey I don't know what gun I might pull out cuz hubby always packing this sucker hand packs right now probably got two things on it now look look look, look at this food he always packing that's law enforcement for you. You said you should get it. Yes. He's always packing because he law enforcement. On top of it, it's on him too. Yeah. Now, look. It, see here? It? It's on him. Girlfriend is always protected, okay? I'm like nationwide. He's always on my side packing. <laughs> He's still going to get to conceal weapons from him, though. I don't want to learn how to shoot no doggone gun. I already know how to do it. You forgot you took me to the... No, y'all, let me take it. I took him on a date to the gun range when we were dating. He didn't think black girl can shoot. I shot that sucker and the whole paper came off. I was like, let me tell you something. Don't get it twisted. I was a Tom girl growing up. I know how to shoot a gun. And I know where to aim it if I want you dead. Or I know how to aim it if I just want to tease you. If I want to tease you, I will shoot your toe off. If I want to kill you, I will go in between your eyes or straight for your heart. Don't try me now. Yeah, Mac. Johnson. That's right. Daddy used to have us outside shooting glass Coca-Cola bottles. I know how to shoot. Don't ever get it twisted. But see, girlfriend ain't trying to do no jail time oh girlfriend can't do jail i'm too pretty for jail Woo. no big lisa might try to come get some <laughs> might have my face thank you i appreciate it get use this bottle of water let me get that other thank you get you too far ahead so so guys what are you giving y'all significant other for Christmas. Absolutely nothing. I ain't got Why is this food well US foods truck. Yeah, but I'm trying to figure out why he bobbing and weaving. That wind that wind kind of shifting. Don't be bobbing and weaving no van truck I'm on this side. Honey, I ain't want to be in the and y'all he hit me, y'all be coming, you looking at me in the caster. Hell no. <laughs> then I have a brand new <laughs> You have a brand new one. <laughs> That's my stuff. You hear this? No, I just messed it. I just playing around. He said the van truck hit me and I get killed. He gonna go get a new Titan. I will burn that hell out of them damn tires every time he damn crank up. <laughs> he getting out of the truck. Nah, I'm just messing around with you. I shake the shoes he walk in. Shake my shoes. Hey, Will. I see them little white sausages. That's what my daughter called unbaked sausages. I need to come with these little soft paws right here. Mama bear. You starting that damn crazy ass mama bear shit. Mama bear, papa bear, baby bear back there. I ain't no bear. Yeah, baby mama, bear. Did you get birth to bear? Nope. Sorry. Yeah, we was in the forest and that's where you were born. In the forest? Actually, I was yep. born in Lexington. Mama bear, born. papa bear. Well, I don't know baby what. Baby bear in the forest. Thank you. Tell him ain't nobody no freaking bear. Shit. But baby bear had it back. Look, he wanna call me a bear. Bear got some paws. I slap and I knock his ass into a coma. Oh no, this big grizzly bear, this big grizzly bear ruled the roost. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. Cause that's how it was when we met. You was up there trying to be all big and bad and I had to let you know the deal. So where is DOT with both of them driving like this? Man, both of that, now that, that tank is supposed to be in the right. This is look better. You still look like somebody bust you in your eye. <laughs> look, Chola, he always talking about mama bear, and papa bear, and baby bear. Look, yeah, we the no three bears. Two bear. We the three bears. We the I'm bear here. family. I am not part of the bear things, bear. Okay, because if I am, they need to give me my monte from those books. Yeah, cause when papa bear came around, mama bear was all mean at me. Thought I was after her cubs and everything. She was protective, and I told her, I ain't after your cubs. I'm after Chola, you. don't put them damn bears in there. <laughs> and I told her, I'm about to you, Mama Bear. Chola, what you doing? Put them damn bears up in there. <laughs> and then you had to put three up. Yeah, good, good. <laughs> no, you didn't. 
No, you didn't. If I'm a bear, and how much did I weigh when I was born? Well, you was a bear. And we the bears, he the big bad wolf. Okay? Nah, I'm the papa bear. She called you a wolf. No, you're talking about the three little pigs. Because that's going to be your last name. Wolf. How they got us stuck behind these girls? We are some idiots. Yeah, what, what? Child. <laughs> Transport police need to be up here to get him. DOT? I hope, what? I think there's a way station coming up. I hope it's open. They have to go through it so I can get out the road. Oh, I know he ain't about to shortcut that truck. Y'all, look at these fools here. That truck right there has no business being over here. And this truck here, well, he driving slow, but he all right. Girl. Riri and guess what? We always like seem we should have been driving Baby Kia because Baby Kia would have been gout. Damn, everybody getting over now. I don't think you be driving slow. You got to hit it when you can split it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Come on, Ram. 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 Yeah, I was gonna show y'all his expression when he trying to drive fast. When he trying to drive fast, there you go. Why are you holding the steering wheel with two wheels? I ain't, I just... Don't be trying to pimp. I ain't pimping. I just run on my way. He's a New Year's pimp. <laughs> He's a P.I.M.P. Oh, that reminds me, our anniversary coming up next month. The 13th. Look, he like, all them cars that are coming. What? If I was driving baby Kia, I would have been gone. I make van trucks get out of my way. I don't play. I get on the road and I don't play. And look at this air ass to the holy hell. The whole darn lane he just sitting there. Come on, North Carolina. Y'all, and guess what, guys? My 22 year old drives just like his mama. Will cuss you out on the road. Mm mm. Me too. Oh, you know they're going to get a ticket. Oh, they done took, they, they tag. Yeah, because they, that car parked on the bridge. You know that's a big violation around here. Y'all, y'all, what y'all gave y'all y'all significant else for y'all wish list for Christmas? I told mine what I wanted for Christmas, and if I don't get mine, he won't get that watch. something simple y'all what I want for Christmas is only $70 that's all I want God damn, I've been throwing that out there to let them know what the girlfriend's out her perfume and uh, I, I need it because like I got on coach right now that's funeral calls what is that that's funeral calls three hearses no that's a hearse and two family calls God, you trying to put a dead person in every one of the cars? Like Good all Lord. Y'all, he's trying to put all the people in the hearse. Mm. And she'll they talking about, we can come early. Didn't I tell woman that we were coming from Georgia? I'm going to get there early. What in the heck is going on? Oh, and when you get up close to Lexington, it's a new whole way. My Sprint notification. Well, my Sprint sending me something. Hello, Sprint. How are you doing? You up on my live? I'm getting time to Sprint. I'm going back to Verizon. This contract is up. How long we got more in the contract? I don't know. I can't think we got um, another, less than a year, another year, somewhere like that. So that mean I can't get my iPhone 11? 
Well, I mean, because Sprint pisses me off, though. I mean, I got in my iPhone and leave. Because, see, I'm on my iPhone 10 Max Pro. There's no problem. There's just There's a problem. Kind of problems on well, it's three different 10, so mine is a 10 what? Max. 10X or something. 10X, Max or something. X, 11 10. Pro. No, but, no, it is. No one says 10 anymore because technically it's X. Not 10. You see, my child is trying to be I'm all technical with her mama. I'm just being honest. Now, what is going on with this track for the day? Today. <laughs> I'm glad I wasn't in route to go to North Carolina because I would not have been a happy camper right about now. Mm -hmm. No, Brown Pound. The TT came out. No, it had to be last year. Yeah, it came it, out last year in November. It came out November last year. They never come out late or in September. It's either September or November. Either or. The the regular one came out first and then they always come the, out at the same time. Okay. Yeah, Chola, uh it came out from what we think in the end of last year. So it's the end of this year. So I have been a perfect little wife all year long. So Me I too. need a new MacBook and a new iPhone. I've been the perfect daughter. I got good grades. Husband. I need Husband. That. I need Holly, if you hear me, hi! I need the pro. My game is trying to, you know, gotta keep that up. I've been a good wife all year long. We ain't had no babies. I've been a good wife all year long. <laughs> she said, we ain't no babies. <laughs> and won't have none either. Mm -mm. The bank is closed. It has been moved from the building. Nope, because it hurt. With this thing come on the back about time. Y'all all up in these South Carolina streets and it's bluffing. That's how it's cackalacky for you. But yeah, Riri, he know when I say eyes, I do that often when I come back in somebody's eyes, I say eyes back. I get, and believe it or not, guess where I got it off? Color purple. Yeah. You ain't heard when she said, all's my life. I had to fight. She said eyes. So now I use it too. But when I'm on my job, I said, uh, no, I can't use it on my job. Yes, you see every woman I come back and I say eyes back. That whenever you pull somebody over, you should be like, What well, kind of forever my brothers and sisters? If my daughter don't stop this darn walk conduct mess. I don't know where she get that stuff from. TikTok. <laughs> Look, life swag, lady swag. Let me tell you something. I'm them old school. I don't like nothing new that came out the re edition of it. I'm like that old school. I want my daddy roll balk. That was the real Annie. I want my real Wizard of Oz. Michael Jackson ain't got nothing to do with getting on down. And uh, that Afro or Diana Ross. No, I don't want them. I want my original. And when it come down to the color purple, don't try me. Ooh, don't try me. Cause the color purple is my thing. Excuse me, I see my daddy die. Up under me. <laughs> Honey. And look, I was at my aunt's house one day. She did, she pushed me out. She told me I had to leave her out. I said, Auntie, your roof got a little leak to it. She said, I know, baby. I got to get it fixed. I said, well, it's about to rain. I said, it's going to rain on your head. She said, I'm going to get out my damn house with that color purple shit. <laughs> I love it. Honey, I love it. My old school original, I love it. Um, it's another one that comes at Christmas time. 20, what is it? Something of the street. 
42 42nd Street. What is it called? It's a Christmas. It's a Christmas um thing. Miracle on 34th Street. Miracle on on what? 34th Street. On Miracle on 34th Street, y'all. Yeah. See, they got a new one that came out in the early I like 90s. The original. I like the original, and the original came out in 1960 something. Yeah. I like the original. It might be longer in length, but it's, but it's so good. Watch it every Christmas holiday. Jazz! Hey, my Puka Luca! I'm telling you, I like my old me this new stuff and they got on the new you make up and they had a different artist it just sound good i said the original record junior was the best baby and i like my old schools just like my kids when i was a single parent i was not married to him we friday night old school jam i would turn up the radio in my den and play all the old school jams the laptop and my daughter to the doctor. The laptop to the doctor and the daughter to the doctor. So we in South Carolina on on I twenty riding. So we are riding you what I do. I love it when he biting that onion. And okay, instrumental's not copyrighted. No, I can listen to instrumental. Don't do nothing. Some honey. Do you like um the Polar Express? Song? Oh yeah, I like Express. Yeah. I watched that oh, the other yeah. day. <laughs> yeah, so some of the old school yeah. stuff. And the original like Rudolph Red Nose Rain. Oh yo, yo, the original. Rudolph okay, see you later, Chola. Rudolph. Yo, the original Rudolph. I love it. Love it. And Frosty the Snowman. And you know what? The the original Peanuts game Christmas. Mm -hmm. I love it. I love those type of things. The original stuff is that's where I am. I don't like this this new stuff. I no. What if my husband got y'all y'all? So my daughter really want to get real sick. Y'all see that? Cause then she gonna have two broke fingers. Mm -hmm. Bye. Bye. I'm a bun your knee. Oh, you only have them. I want a bunny for Christmas. Yeah, you see that? The girl want her fingers broke. I'm a RN. I wrap them and tape them up and send them right on the school. I wrap them up and tape them in duct tape and a popsicle stick. Right on the school you go. Yes, what you think? Before there was splints, the original splints was popsicle sticks. Lord, you got to teach your young kids the old school. I'm not a doctor. I mean, I was gonna go to school to be a doctor, but I was like, heck no. But um, I stop at RN. But yes, popsicle sticks. If you get a finger broke at home, it's not out of place. You use popsicle sticks. Exactly, Jazz. They don't know about this stuff. You hear this crazy child of mine tell my can she use a popsicle stick and duct tape for her ankle? <laughs> yeah, Jazz. But I done been to school for so many stuff. I really want to go back for my NP. I was really thinking about it starting that back next month, and it's only two years for me to get my NP. But I just keep thinking about going to school, working and going to school, and hey, I like his car. I don't know if I'm gonna do that. Cause right now, both of the boys in school, my oldest one just got his um, associate degree, and he will have his master's in sports and commentator communication, whatever it is, in August. And my other one is in college at the same college in Orlando, Florida, for entertainment, um, mar entertainment marketing or something like that. He's in school for. Guess what, guys? Both of my boys are at the same college with Jaru's son. Okay, this college is high as heck, and broke little me can afford to take her kids through where 
famous people with the money kids are going. So Ja Rule's son is at Full Sail University in Winter Park, Florida, and both of my boys are at the same college. Isn't that crazy? Ja Rule got socks, a uh, one pair of socks more than what his one pair of socks is more than what I got in my bank account right now, okay? And my boys are going to the same college. Um, when my older one graduate and with his master's next year, of course, I'm going to do it on live. And guess what, y'all? Ja Rule's son is graduating with my son. So you already know I'm going to be trying to get Ja Rule all up in the video, right? <laughs> Baby girl, I'm going to try to get Ja Rule all up in that thing. Yes, Full Sail University is expensive as all outdoors, baby. Please cut the heat. I'm hot. Um, it is expensive per semester, not year. Per semester is thirty thousand dollars. Okay, but see, with me having my education also in teaching. I used to write grants for a school in South Carolina. So I did a lot of grants for my kids for this college. My 20 year, old, 20, um, 20 year old was at Johnson and Whale in Charlotte, North Carolina. Well, he was on the Dean's list the whole entire time. His loan amount at the end was only $16. Why? Because mama knows how to do these grants is so many kids and that's the biggest thing i teach at a middle school i so really want to be at the high school because i want to get with parents to teach them how they can get grants for their kids and pay absolutely no money for them to get an education um my oldest son believe it or not i got a ten thousand dollar grant for him being African American and wear glasses. It is crazy what you can get a grant for. And if I can get the grant, oh, I'm getting it. Cause college is no joke. And I wish I would've knew that back when I was in college. Cause the last time I graduated with college was in 05, 2005, when I got my nursing degree. If I would have known that, I would not have $16,000 still tagging on my happy butt right now. Keita, what's wrong? But, Keita, what's wrong? Nurse Johnson is on duty. Okay, what's wrong, boo boo? You want me to get cast wrong? I got some casserole heated up, put a little bit of decent crystal sugar in it. It will take it all. Oh no, you got a migraine. No, that won't do for that. You told me about two weeks ago you had a migraine. Keitha, on a serious note, get that check. You need a MRI scan of your brain. I'm telling you that because I went through migraines real bad after a car accident in 90, in 1991, nope, I'm lying. I had my son in 97, in 1995. I was in a very bad car accident and my head hit the window and I was suffering from migraines real bad to come to find out that I have a vessel in my brain that broke and they wanted to do brain surgery. I was like, no, 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 no. Oh, oh wow. Oh, that's not good. Now we're going to Lexington. Yeah, going to Columbia. Yeah, this thing split you up, but at the end, you end up back the same way. Yeah, Keitha, you need to um, have they did a brain scan on you? Because I'm telling you, that can be something serious. Um, I told somebody that I know very well. Oh gosh, that's major surgery. That's a major, major surgery.
See, I, I was going through migraines so, so, so bad till it affect my eyes. See, a lot of y'all don't even know this eye, my right eye, I'm blind in my right eye. I am 97% blind in my right eye. What? Keep. They did do, did they do it with the dye when you had the MR, the CT scan? Did they do it with the blue dye? Because a lot of times you can't see a lot of stuff if you don't do it with the nuclear dye. Because I kept telling my doctors I was sick some years ago and I pushed and I told them, look, I got children, I need to live. Look, I have Blue Cross and Blue Shield, dang it, we gonna use it. So they did a nuclear test on me and that's when they found out what was going on with my brain. Yes, they did and I had, oh wow. I am so sorry, cause I know what how it feels to have migraines. What I did to lighten up my migraines when they told me that I would have to have um, brain surgery to correct it, I did lots of research. I also have major heart issues and I, I did a lot of research. You know you'll be in my prayers and you on my IG so you already know I'm going to be contacting you like, hey unfiltered, hi girlfriend, but um, I, you know I'm going to be checking on you because I know the only thing that stopped my migraines, believe it or not, I start I started drinking um, the apple cider vinegar with the mother. Adding a grapefruit, a fresh grapefruit in it. For some odd reason, the acids in that relieve some of the mist of me not being able to get up just to lift my head or just to turn over to get up to go to the bathroom it would hurt so bad till i end up with kidney disease i almost had to go on dialysis because of it because it was just hurt so bad for me just to get up but um i started drinking apple cider vinegar with the mother with fresh grapefruit and we'll put it in the refrigerator overnight and we'll drink it all day long. And I'm telling you, that helped me so much. The doctors kept giving me, I had a neurologist, kept giving me stuff and I told Dr. White, I said, look, you are wasting my money. Besides my insurance being wasted, I'm wasting money coming to pay $75 co-pays and I'm coming twice a month and nothing is changing. So I started doing some serious research on my own and doing that research, I guess it'll be back in a few minutes. Okay, I'm back. They working on the roads around here. Oh, wow, Keitha. I'm so sorry because I know that I have those headaches are just like terrible. I thought you told me you was playing instrumental. But I know I, I've been there, done that, and I'm telling you, I know what they feel like, ever because it pushes on your nerves. Your head is feel like it's finna explode. Your eyes are hurting and even my was messing with my sinuses so I know your pain but that's like the only thing like probably twice a year I get a migraine and I sleep I whenever I have pain I just literally sleep because that's the only way I can get around it because pain medicine too many pain medicines are not good for me having serious serious heart issues so um I just y'all my husband playing gypsies the gypsies the kings lord have mercy I was like what the heck Spanish but um 
I sure hope this, but they're going to do New Year's Eve. I hope it works for all God's a long time. Just stay in this lane. They're supposed to stay over there. It's cursing. I, well, at least I thought they were supposed to stay over there. Oh, crap. This lane here getting ready to open up the three lanes. I am so sorry about that. You know that you are definitely my presence. I don't care when I'm on live. I look up. I see you. So, you know I'm going to be checking on you. Because it's one other person. Uh, what is her name? She, she, she don't have a YouTube, but she, she comes on and support us. Uh, what is her name? I can't think of a name. I messed a DM her earlier because I I DM her every other day because I know she's going through a lot of stuff and that's why she hasn't been on any lives. But um, I'm one. I don't know if it's the nurturing type of side of me. If I know something going on with you, I'm going to check on you. Look at the police on standby. Go ahead, South Carolina State. Hey, boo -boo. He's sitting there waiting to get him a ticket. But I'm one, and that's the nurturing side of me. If I know something going on, mm -hmm. just like TK Tanay, TK, when I know something going on, hey, I, I am not nosy. I don't want to know none of your business. Of all of y'all may be gone because we just got in Columbia. Oh, and the state trooper back there and not behind him. And it's new. That's all right. Another state trooper be up there, you can give him a feel. People so stupid. Ain't nobody trying to lose their life. Look at that steady flying. After I got hit by the drunk driver, I'm telling you, I'm so scared of, of people and they driving. Because getting hit by a drunk driver is just no joke. It could have been worse, but thank God it wasn't. Y'all still here? Because this thing was trying to reconnect. Five minutes to get to Fall Port. Fall Northeast. Kill your road. I'm sorry, Fall Road. Oh, hell. Hey, he hit that wall. Oh, he, that's why I'm getting around from because he, he going to deflect when he hit that wall. He is not hitting us. If it, yeah, hey. What is wrong with these people here? I've seen it happen. Hi. I've seen Lita. It happen got hit in the wall and he was, and he would have bounced off and could have How about you helping get from behind him? Because <coughs> he takes it on the freaking phone. These people are so stupid. Oh, uh oh, a state trooper flying over there. Right. They driving a baby Kia? Going after somebody. Yes, sir. South Carolina ain't playing, y'all. Had me right so bad. These um state troopers in South Carolina, y'all are not playing, honey. They flying around here like hot cakes. They getting this Christmas quota. Yep, these summer quotas. You gotta get in there before the first. I know day. they. These state troopers, they have yep. hunting the life of a police wife. One thing, but you know what is the craziest thing? I'm a school teacher and hubby is an officer, but you know we never talk about each other's job. When we get home, unless it's a kid and I'm really ticked me off, but we don't talk about work. You don't see that's the craziest thing? I just leave my job.
off. We don't we don't ever talk about what happened at work. Look at this fool! Idiot. Already got half of the bumper hanging off. We going to take two to the doctor. Oh, we going to take the laptop to the doctor and my daughter to the doctor. So I just decided to look a little different. A little different. You know why? Look who drive is in 49th. But really we had to leave from one state to the next state. We still go, um, our daughters are still in South Carolina. So we taking baby girls to the pediatrician. So we had to leave Georgia to come to Columbia, South Carolina. So we probably are give or take, we late because it's three minutes and her appointment is in three minutes. And ain't no way we gonna get there in three minutes. So, um, I ain't heard that in years. That cherry is so fine. Wow. I ain't heard that since Cool Runnings. That used to be on Cool Runnings. Mm -hmm. When they got ready to do the bobsled and the, the yeah. last one and they were um that was on Cool Runnings. Yeah, that's the soundtrack for the movie Cherry is so fine. Got this darn cement truck. You going around, you got to push it. So guys, we are officially in Columbia, South Carolina, where I live for 20, I live here 20, 23 years. I went to college down here. Yeah, I live here in 23 years, my last college, the last two colleges. Um, hi! My last two colleges I graduated from, I graduated from, from Columbia. It looks so weird and different when I come. We need to yeah, stop going back over. But yeah, we, we, we almost there, girl. We almost there. One good thing about y'all, let me tell you, my daughter, pediatrician, I called to the doctor to get her an appointment, right? And I told him, you know I'm coming from Georgia, so it got to be in the afternoon. So she was like, oh, that doctor's on maternity leave. I said, then she just had a baby. I'm like, honey, husband, busy. Somebody who bored. They ain't got uh-uh-uh-uh, because you could be getting off the interstate soon. Okay. Honey, they, they humping hard. That's two babies under the age of two. 